bacon, but I made up a bunch of bacon. And then something that I did too is I had some extra and I just crumbled up some bacon and made some bacon bits instead of paying like 10 bucks for bacon bits. I did that. And then I have two really neat recipes for bread. I took fathead pizza and I actually made little sandwich circles. Look at how beautiful this is, you guys. So it's really simple, fathead pizza to make um, one pizza or to make about four little sandwich rounds. Are you ready for how easy this is? You take one and three quarter cups of mozzarella, shredded mozzarella. You take three quarter cup of almond flour and you um, take two tablespoons of cream cheese. Mix that together, put some seasonings, maybe some garlic um, powder, some salt. We have this butt rub that we love from Costco. It's so yummy. Mix that up, put it in the microwave for one minute, okay? If you don't have a microwave, I know we've got some purists in there. And yes, Amanda, you can freeze these. They're amazing. Um, you can melt it really low on in a sauce pot, okay? So put it in for one minute, take it out, mix it up, put it in for another 30 seconds, Oh, good. Mom's here. Hi, Mom. Ask Nurse Cindy's my hero in life. Okay, put it in for, okay, so a minute, stir, another 30 seconds, stir, and then mix in one egg. Stir it up. It's going to become this doughy kind of goopy texture. Keep mixing until that egg is there. And then all you're going to do is you're going to flatten it out on parchment paper. Don't do it on foil. And if you do it just directly onto the baking sheet, make sure that you put a, a good amount of like coconut oil or butter down so it doesn't stick. And then bake it um, on 375 for 8 to 10 minutes. And I'm going to post that recipe up above. But what I found is that <laughs> my mom did this as well. Um, she took it, and you can make this really great sandwich bread texture. So instead of making one big pizza, I just separated them into little rounds. And it's so easy. It's so yummy. It really only takes about five minutes total from mixing everything together. Maybe eight if, like, I'm talking, which happens. Um, and, and they're super yummy and they're super easy. And so what we did yesterday, cause we were, yesterday was a really busy day. It was a really late day. I don't think we crawled into bed till like 1130, but, um, you can use it as sandwich bread. You can rebroil it. And, oh, I love all the hearts and the, 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 the likes and everything. That makes me so happy. Um, you can make it into sandwich bread. Uh, we put bacon on it, a little bit of ranch, a little bit of mayo. He, my husband did ham, and he put a little bit of sriracha on there. He was like a happy camper. So that is something we found. Um, so I made four of those, and then I took some of the dough, and I made those little pigs in a blanket that I posted uh, last week. Wow, look at all the hearts. I'm just loving this. This is so much fun. Yay! <laughs> um, anyways, another, so that, that one's a little bit more complicated because you have to mix and you have to put everything together.